going on everybody I'm here with Justin and tomorrow is Justin's birthday and today we are going fishing that's right yeah taking him to the super secret Texas marsh where I'm gonna try to put him on his first kayak redfish and then or either or we're gonna try to get him his first sight casted redfish but uh should be a fun trip so Justin has just informed me that I am the plug please elaborate all right so basically I brought almost nothing and he's letting me use all the stuff so he's just hooking me up with everything so he's the plug the plug the plug it's like a little thing we cruising this is what you do when you have one pedal boat and one paddle boat. You help the other guy out. <laughs> That's what you think so far. I'm really liking it. Yeah. It's awesome. It's pretty uh it's pretty cool once you get out here and you get away from the hustle and bustle of everything. Serene. Teaching someone how to sight cast a redfish is extremely hard. Here's the story. I wanted to take Jay out for his birthday and I wanted to put him on his first redfish. Well, that didn't go according to plan. Damn it. There's a redfish up here, Jay. It's coming out of that opening. There was paddling and fatigue issues. Are you getting tired? Yeah? Alright. Let's change our game plan then. Let's change our game plan then. Does paddling, is paddling tire you out? Tire you out? No, like sitting down and paddling? Alright, let's do that then. Moving too slow, making too much noise, not being ready when there was a fish present, and of course, failed casts. Stop! Jay, cast right there! Are you not paying attention? No, I was pointing to you, pointing to it for you. Get your get your rod and reel ready. You see that wake? Throw right over there. Come on, man, you gotta hurry up. Take him way too long. That was a redfish. Look for the wake, throw at the wake. You know, trying to teach somebody how to fish, I learned that it's always constant education and a practice in patience. No! Damn it! He took the bait off! What? We did have a little bit of action. So then we started heading back. There was one spot I knew was going to have a high percentage of holding a redfish. So I began to tell Jay, look, position yourself along this shoreline don't make too much noise, and you're gonna cast right in the middle of this drain. After a few failed casts, I threw over exactly where I wanted him to throw. Then I caught Jay's fish. All in all, he was super stoked and thankful I took him out fishing for his birthday.
You want to take a picture with it? So we headed back to the launch and made a few more memorable experiences. Gonna, on my face. People want to see that. People want to see the, the speed. Power. I'm cruising. All right, now we're racing. What not to do when you're paddling? Must be nice to ride a water bicycle. Woo! It's about the most excitement we've had today. Yep. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Share it with your friends. Check me out on Instagram at Shane Kuvert. Come fishing with me one day. You know, I have people reach out to me all the time. When I first started kayak fishing, I reached out to people. There's a few that took took me under their wing. And there was a few that gave me the cold shoulder. You know, I try to, to, to be open to everybody. I have to be careful, though, because some people that reach out to me just want to know where I go fishing, and that'll be the end of it. So I encourage you to follow me on social media. You know, become more than just a social media follower. You know, we went out, I went out with a buddy a few trips ago, and he, has, he followed me. We met face to face at the Houston Boat Show. He introduced himself, he said he was a fan, I got his number, we exchanged numbers, and we ended up fishing together. So, if you wanna personally come fish with me, that's the best route to take, you know. It's more than just knowing fishing spots. So Jay, happy birthday, I hope you enjoyed this trip. I hope it doesn't discourage you to go out with me again. Hang on. God dang it. Waiting on you. Run out of time, better hurry up. Oh, I hit the wrong spot. <laughs> I missed. Oh my goodness.